obviously we're delighted that we have the Olympic Flame in from Anna today, where we have organised a fun day um, for the family. Fortunately, the weather is a bit inclement, but we have no control over that, but we'll certainly make the best of, of the occasion. Well, we have the Bouncy Castles and Outdoor Recreation. We have some mini Olympics organised for the children, and um, I suppose trying to replicate what the, the Olympic spirit is about, and hopefully everyone will despite the weather will have a good day and, and, and enjoy themselves. There are local people involved and, and again I think that's part of, of what's exciting about this project is giving local people the opportunity to be involved and indeed our chairman hosted a reception for them to recognise the significance of that and, and it was very well received. I am the Olympic torch bearer today. I was nominated by the Northern Ireland Cancer Group for Children for my involvement with the charity since my daughter was diagnosed with cancer two years ago. My family, my friends, work colleagues, um, the people I support is brilliant, they're all here. And I have some friends and colleagues from the charity that have nominated me as well. So. I was nominated because of the work I've done for a charity called the Smiles Foundation, which works with orphans in Romania. Well, our schools signed up to the Get Set program on my year at nominated Charity. Sometimes when you're so far west, things don't often get out to um, Enniskillen, and it is the most westerly point that the torch is going to um, visit. So it's a great opportunity, and the fact that it's so close to everybody, that there's not one that shouldn't have been in today to see the torch. So hopefully everyone will have made the effort and come out to see it somewhere along the track. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's not every day it comes through. Uh, I thought it was class, but I got to hold it. I got to hold it yep, over there. We got a picture of each other holding it. Yes, we, we did see the were in time to see the torch go into the castle and I thought it was really exciting to see it come to Enniskillen. I thought it was wonderful. I mean, I'll never see another one, I don't think. Not in any skill in any way. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Yeah, right. and come down to Geographically, we're we're um, on the periphery of Northern Ireland, so it's, it's great that we can we can bring the Olympic flame here, and we're delighted that they've agreed to, to come here. Um, we're a very proud county, um, and and I'm sure the turnout today will will show you that people are are excited about the flame coming here.